I bought Pop Fit clothing. I'm gonna open it up live for you and show you what I got and try it on. Wow. I don't think any of these will fit. Oof. Great. You're killing me! Unless they stretch a ton, this is, I do not wear this size at all. I'm assuming they stretch a lot, otherwise <laughs> I'm gonna be really upset. The pants are too small, which is a good and bad thing. Um, good thing is, is, as I continue to lose more weight, I won't have to buy a whole nother set of leggings and bras and whatnot. Now, you thick thigh friends out there, I'm sure you know the feeling of having your thighs touch. I was kind of hoping that these pants would go in between my thigh folds. You know, I'm gonna get rubbed with really bad in this area, so I'm gonna have to put like chafing cream or something when I wear these, which I shouldn't have to. I'm remaining hopeful. Let me know what you think. Okay, so this is my second outfit. I like this one a little bit more. I was able to kind of get it up in my folds. Gross! So I don't think I would sweat as much as I did in the previous pair in this area, which really sucks. I made the mistake with uh, putting this bra on with these pants. It looks way better. This is the final of the three. I like how this looks. Okay, overall impressions just by trying them on. Um, I was a little disappointed at first because this area here, I'm gonna have to be really careful when I exercise with these. It's polyester and spandex, so there's no cotton in here. So I'm assuming this is gonna like get really sweaty when I start working on it. You already see I'm sweating now, but that's because it's hot. I was originally really upset when I opened the container, but now that I tried them on and saw them, they look pretty good. I'm going to continue this review and let you know how I feel. See ya! So I decided to go on a walk and I found this trail that was extended from the original trail that I usually walk on and it's actually really nice and peaceful. I've only seen like two or three people so I might be able to walk and vlog here. It would be really dope. I usually walk this path anyways but you can cross underneath this very shady looking bridge. You can almost touch the ceiling. I I guess this is a good invention if you want to make a crosswalk, but terrifying. I think I'm going to start walking this path from now on. I think it's like two or three miles. So I just got back from my hour walk. It was really hot out, so I always have a towel with an ice pack in the back so I don't die. Oh, but the towel is wet from just me sweating. It seems that these leggings might not be the best for walking in these weather circumstances. Out of all three pairs that I own, these pants are the stretchiest. Like, I don't think my thighs are touching. So that's great. I, uh, I'm gonna wear this all day. I have a lot of stuff I need to do. Let's see if this outfit withstands a whole day of everyday activity. I'll let you know at the end of the day after I take them off. Do I get red burn or not? We shall see. I went all over town today just getting dirt and rocks and herbs and everything for my little garden outside and I sweated so much I was dying. So you can safely assume from that that this pair, the red pair that I had on this morning, is life proof. You can use it for everyday activities. And I even garden in these things and they were fine. So uh, definitely recommend this pair out of all three of the leggings I bought. Okay, here's my honest review. 
Austin and Valentina were my favorite out of all of them. Second favorite would be Sadie and Rory. And then third favorite would be Violet and Yara. The all black pants, I had very little thigh touching, but the black and burgundy pair just didn't meet the cut. Before you go out and buy yourself a pair of pop fit leggings and matching sports bra, please make sure to take your measurements. I took my measurements and still the pants were a little tight in some areas, so do yourself a favor and take accurate measurements before you invest in their products. Thanks for watching.